Uh, in this video, I'm going to be doing a uh, compression test on this Yard Pro 130A gas trimmer, and uh, going to be using this compression gauge. Uh, it comes with this adapter, and the only other tool you'll need is uh, the correct spark plug socket and a ratchet to remove the spark plug. The first step is to remove the spark plug, but before you do that, make sure there's no dirt or debris around the plug uh, so that doesn't fall into the cylinder when you remove the spark plug. I'm going to use compressed air to clean around the spark plug, but you can also, if you don't have compressed air, you can just use a rag. Next, uh, remove the plug. The uh, next step is to uh, choose the correct uh, compression gauge adapter for your engine. Uh, you want it to have the correct thread size and be the correct length and you can do that by comparing it to your, the spark plug that you just removed. Um, you want the uh, adapter thread length to be uh, e either equal or shorter than the uh, threads on your spark plug and be the same, the, the correct size. Uh, you can see here that this adapter is obviously too long. and. Uh, this adapter here at the end is just right. It's the same size threads and it's shorter than the threads on my spark plug. So I know that this, this adapter isn't going to hit the piston when I insert it or screw it into the engine. And you can see this bottom adapter is just, uh, just too, too big for the engine I'm working on. So take your adapter and screw it into the engine uh, finger tight. Now if you have a uh, compression gauge like mine, uh, attach the compression gauge to the uh, adapter you just inserted into the engine. Um, make sure that you turn the ignition switch off because you don't want to put any unnecessary uh, stress on your ignition system when you pull the engine over. Uh, grab your throttle, open it up all the way. You want your engine to breathe as much as possible when you're doing this test. And I'm going to pull the engine over uh, or turn the engine over until this gauge stops moving. The uh, compression reading I get for this engine is uh, approximately 135 um, PSI. Um, I don't have a manual for this uh, trimmer just because it's so old, but so I don't know the correct specs, but I would consider this a good reading. Uh, if you got any questions, leave them in the comments section, or um, I have a website called thesmallengineshop.net, which I'll put a link in the uh, description. And on that website, there's a link to a form where you can uh, leave questions there. There's no uh, uh, character limit on your comment on the forum, but either way I can I still answer questions on YouTube or at the website uh, Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, hope it was helpful and thanks for watching